he is singer. How are you? Hi, how are you? Okay, do you want to answer why your prophet he says that the women she have a sperm and her sperm coming from her nipples? First of all, could I ask you a question, please? No, you answer the question first, then you can ask me a question. Could please. you could you translate the thing I read for you before, please, later on? We sure. I I promise you. I promise you. Thanks. And I I swear by the fig, I would do. Okay. By way, by the way, why Allah swear by the fig? Allah swears by anything He wants. Okay. Do He swear by by shoes? Don't go down low, brother. What, you so, are... so fig. Why He swear by fig? I want you to answer. You said to me He swear by anything He want. I can swear by anything I want. Can you swear Allah by swear, Allah swears are you, by are you, are you, uh, the world, the universe, okay, go, the heavens. Sharia, Allah swears by the light. On, everything on, Allah swears on, by He wants to. Hold on. When you go to Sharia court, you swear by fig or you swear by Allah? Alhamdulillah. No, no. I'm asking you. Don't tell me Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. What is the answer? When you go to the court, we when, swear you, by Allah. when you go to the court, do you swear by Allah or you swear by fig? If Alhamdulillah, we swear by Allah. If you don't, okay, so you swear by Allah. That's mean that God. You swear by Allah because why? Because He's God. Allah is Alhamdulillah, the Almighty okay, God who created Allah? us. You have to stop repeating. Why you swear by Allah? Okay, because He is the Creator, according to you. Okay, thank you very much. So, guys, He Allah, Allah, He swear by, by uh, He this guy, He swear by Allah because Allah is the Creator. So, when Allah He swear by fig, does that mean that fig is the Creator of Allah? No, 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 no. So why he swear by the? You, you are the one who said to me you swear by Allah because he's the Creator, the one who created. There is nothing on top okay. of Allah. Well, then you tell me why Allah he swear by the fig. Because there is nothing on top of him he can swear by. What do you mean? This is uh, so you are saying oh be, because there's nothing on top of him so he swear by fig. I mean you are I'm convinced. Brother, have you have you read your own Bible? Don't, don't tell me I read. No, I did not read the Bible by Prophet Muhammad. It swears by the water. No, 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 no. You can, you can show me the verse and we, we, and we will read together. And now answer. Why Allah, he read, he swear by the fake. What is, what is specific about the fake? The, I don't know. It's up to Allah. I okay. can't answer the wrong story. You, are you saying to us that your God, Allah, he worship fakes? I'm sorry, Allah, I can't answer that. Why you cannot? Because I have no knowledge. I don't speak of something I have no knowledge of. You don't of, have sorry. any degree in fig or anything like that? Did you go to the fig school or in the fig university? Oh, I'm sorry. But okay, can you translate okay, the verse? Okay, I'll okay, show you before, back, please. We go back to our topic. As long as you admit, you cannot answer that. Why your God, he says, that women, she have a sperm and her sperm coming from her breast, the location of the necklace. What kind of God, he says that? Oh, no, I'm not a doctor. Sorry, brother. I'm not a doctor, too. But according to your prophet, Women, she have a sperm. Listen, okay. Listen, I'll answer you. I'll answer you. Hmm. Please listen, okay. I'm listening. If Allah says that the sky is a physical thing, it is a physical thing. Whatever Allah says, according to the Muslims around the world, is 100 percent true. Hmm. Allah told us how you create a baby inside the woman's stomach. Nobody else in history has ever done that until today. How the baby is created in the stomach. Is the baby is created in the stomach? Uh, and that's last time I, I I thought the baby is created in the liver, in the stomach. Tell the Quran. Read the Quran. The Quran is funny. The Quran. Here we go. This is the Quran. Your prophet saying, your God saying that the baby is created in the following way. There's a sperm of the woman coming from the ribs of the woman, especially location of the of the necklace, and there is a sperm of the man coming from the backbone, and those are both are wrong. So what do you mean? I agree listen, with you. listen, listen. I listen. agree with you. You say that nobody explained it in such listen, a way please, before. Please listen. Are you listening? Go ahead. I am warning you. Are you warning me? Okay. I'm scared. I'm scared I'm now. Warning. Okay. You know what? I am warning you. Okay, warn me. Listen to this. Okay, I'm listening. Okay. I give them a short time. What Indeed, my punishment what is what severe. What KD mean? What KD mean? What KD mean? Does that mean Allah is deceiver? No. You said to me in the, no, no. In the Kaidi Mateen, Listen. you are the one who said to me a second ago in the Kaidi Mateen, everybody heard you, you cannot take it back. I swear by mm. the fig, you said that. I swear by the fig. Now, did you say the word Kaidi? Kaidi mean deception. Why your God Allah is saying to me in the Kaidi Mateen, my deception is strong. Well, read the verse. Reading what? Answer me. Your why, translation why is wrong. Saying, why you are saying to me that in the Kaidi Mateen, my deception is strong. Uh, I'm sorry, bro. You have no knowledge of Arabic. I'm uh, sorry. My friend, no, I can approve it for you. We are Arab here, brother. You are not an Arab. You are a Somalian boy. S Somali boy? Yes, you are not an Arab. Speak to me in Arabic. 
Speak to me in Arabic. Yes. Min I, min I, min Egypt, min Misr, or min Speak to me in Arabic. You are not an Arab. You are a liar. Speak to me in Arabic. Go ahead. Min Saudi or min Misr. Speak to me in Arabic. Let us, let us laugh. Ay Arab, ya akhi, ay Arab. Speak to me in Arabic. It's not Arabic. Where is the Arabic? Speak to me in Arabic. I'm going to say something to you. You translate. Is that okay? Yeah. Hadi liflus jantan jantilus. What I said. Hadi li. Hadi liflus jantan jantilus. Ya akhi, anta himar. You are you are the himar, and Muhammad is married to a woman. Her last name is Himar. Why you calling me Himar? Ya akhi. اقرا 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 الكتاب you are not an Arab you don't speak Arabic and you are a liar now let's go back you said that Allah he taught us how the baby is created okay I want to ask you if the man have orgasm first the baby will look like the parents if the women have orgasm first I mean the father if the woman have orgasm first the baby will be a female do you agree with that Listen, I'll tell you. Would you listen to me answer? Yes, go ahead. According to the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam, he said that the baby will come out and will resemble the one who had the orgasm first. Okay. So, 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 do you look like your father? I know. You don't look like the father. Obviously, obviously, your father is not your father then, because you just admit. No, no, I am. I am a doctor. No, no, no. You just admit it. You just admit it. That the one who have Allah, hey, I haven't seen my parents in 18 years. Allah, I don't know, bro. I'm sorry. Hold on. You just admitted that your father is not your father. Your mother is sleeping with somebody else because you are the one who said if the man have orgasm first, the baby will resemble the the father, which means he will be a male and he will look like his father. And you don't look like your father. So obviously, your father is not the one who slept with your mother. Christian friends, let me tell you. This is from my heart. I am telling you. I haven't seen my parents in a very 18 to 20 years. I'm Wallahi, I am very. I'm a doctor. You are the one who just said you don't look like your father, and you are the one who says to me, if a man have orgasm first, the the baby will resemble the man. So how do you know I don't look like my father? I don't even know. You just said that to me. I asked you, do you look like your father? You said no. Wallah, I did not say that, brother. Maybe I got you wrong then. Okay, so you look like your father. I've seen pictures of my mother. I look more okay. like my mother. You look like this is what I'm saying. So obviously, it's not it's, it, this. Your father is not your father because according to your prophet, you just confirmed that your prophet is lying because you just said you look like your mother. And the prophet, by what he meant here, that your child will resemble the father, which means he will be a male and he will look like a father. Not only he will look as a face, he will be a male, and he will resemble the man, which is your father. And you just said you don't know no, like this father. one says which of, of them comes first so whoever orgasm first yes whoever of them comes first that's and me. man there's not orgasm for the moving it depends yes yes uh, my friend whoever comes first he will resemble the man and he will be a male and he will be looking like the father and you just said no he will be looking like the one who orgasm said if the mother yes, orgasm yes, says i will look correct. like the mother he will be a male he will be a male that's why he's explained why the male is a male and female is a female not only you will look like the, the father you will be a male to be to look like your father you will be a male and i can show the hadith says it clearly that he is going at the i'm looking i'm male. looking at the hadith now in front it says whoever um orgasm first or comes first that is what the baby is going to look like a mother can come first before the father you know that right okay so uh, so are you saying that your prophet did not say he, he is saying that it's going to be male Listen, if the Prophet of Allah said that the sky is yellow, the sky is yellow. No, no, I'm asking you, did your Prophet say he will be a male? Yes or no? I don't see it on written here. I, I don't know. I have no only I'm sorry. Okay, if I show it to you, what you will do? Are you going to make fun of your Prophet? If you show it to me, I will accept it. Okay, so that means you are not the son of your father. The Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, okay. Al Arab, he is a Prophet. You can, listen, Somalian boy. You are not the son of your father according to your prophet. Do you agree with that? Yes or no? To be honest, I haven't seen my father in 18 years. I don't know. Sorry, what? Um, wallahi, I am adopted brother. I am adopted. I haven't seen my family in 18 years. I wish I could see my father. but okay, I can't I, I, I'm more. sorry for that, my friend, but this is not, the, not my, my case now. I'm just we are talking about Islam, about not your family. I don't mean to uh, to insult you or to harm you. So I'm asking you, what kind of a prophet he such a thing? So what? What kind of a prophet he says such a funny thing if he is speaking of Allah? Well, everything he's saying is about the baby is wrong. Women have an orgasm first, have nothing to do how the baby look like. How do you know? Well, all Muslim women they don't have orgasm. 
What are you talking about? <laughs> Muslim women don't I have, have orgasm right. because you do circumcision for them. How they will have orgasm? You cut it. No, 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 no. no. You got it wrong. Okay, let me ask you. Did the prophet wife have orgasm? I'm sorry, I can't be knowledge on this. Okay. But the prophet okay. 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 he murdered his wife and he enjoyed his wife. I will show you. I will show you. I will show you. I will show you. Here we go. This is the prophet wife. She never have orgasm and she is saying that. What do you say? Hmm? What do you say? I just want to read it. Really? And this is your Muslim. You, speak, you said you speak Arabic, right? Read it for us. Go ahead. Let us see your Arabic. I can't see it. No, you can see it now. Go ahead. No, we're gonna read it. Okay, go ahead. Go a little bit off. Read, read this part here. It says here. Read this part. I highlight it for I you. I can't see it. Oh, no, I can't see it. Go a little bit up. Oh, no, no, no. Here. فقلت فضحت النساء وهل تج وهل تحتل وهل تحتل مل مرأة قال النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم. So what she said to him, as long as you claim that you speak Arabic. Arabia to Nasser, ya akhi, nal fushah. You don't know Arabic, why well, you are lying? So let us make a you You're a private wife, she said, do women have orgasm? Do women come? She never have come. Allah, I cannot comment on the relationship with the Prophet, but there is one thing I can okay, comment on. Prophet, okay, this means your Prophet, he was not having sex with his wife, or with somebody else. I, well, I can't comment. The Prophet had many wives. I oh, can't comment on it. Okay, I'm sorry. No, pro no problem. But obviously, this is his wife, and he is not doing a good job. You know, he need to see to, to Dubai some Viagra or something. No. Alhamdulillah, Allah has given the Prophet okay, all the wives he wanted. Back, Alhamdulillah, and the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he said, okay. he said, Allah has chosen some wives for me. Alhamdulillah. What uh, uh, Allah? She, what? She, what? What? Allah has given the wives all the prophet, all the all the prophet, all the wives he wanted. Alhamdulillah. Allah, he gave him all the wives. Allah married the prophet, the wives of the prophet to him. No, so Muhammad, he did not marry women. It was Allah who married them to him. What? It was like Allah. He was like he was a dating website, and Allah, he is the one who sent him the women. Well, listen. Hmm. There are our mothers, Ummuna. There are our mothers. Hmm. Okay, your mothers. So Aisha, when Allah He sent Aisha to Muhammad at the age of six years old, why Allah He recommended Aisha to be in his bed? Well, do you know what Aisha has done for Islam? What she, what she done? What she done? She made a war against Ali and Aisha. Aisha let us know everything about the Prophet ﷺ in his house. Like what? Everything like, we like did what? not know privately. She told us. She explained to us everything you have to do when you enjoy your wife. She explained to us everything you have to do in the middle of the night when you want to pray. She she explained to us everything about the private life of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And I promise you, there is not a single woman on this earth except the, except Maryam Alaihi Salam. That is after Aisha Alaihi Salam. Nobody. Okay, I want you to read this for me. Here we go. Aisha is reporting what is inside the house. Read it. One of the words of the Prophet's apostle joined him in a tikaf, and she noticed blood and yellowish discharge from her fellow parts, and she did under her when she prayed. Hmm. Okay. Okay, why the Prophet wife she is reporting what is coming from her vagina or the vagina? Of Allah, I cannot, I cannot come and say, I have not knowledge. No, no you this. are the one who's saying she report to us things nobody knows. Here we go. This is what she reports to us. Prince, Christian Prince. No, don't tell me, Christian Prince. I want to know what kind of a woman she report what is coming from her vagina or the vagina of a woman Christian in the Prince. house of her okay. husband. Can I say something? You can say, but I want an answer. Why she is reporting? Aisha. What Aisha, is the benefit? Yeah. Aisha. Of, what is the Everybody benefit? Everybody hates an Aisha. Listen, listen, but listen, I am telling listen. You. Stop, stop playing games. Why the wife of the prophet, if she had dignity, do you like your wife to come to our chat here? And she call us, and she says yesterday there's a, Allah, there's a yellowish, there's a yellowish liquid coming from my vagina. 
Do you appreciate your wife saying that? I can't. I can't. I can't come because I have no. You know, Muslims. They can't come. No, you can't comment. No a second ago, you were proud about Aisha. Now you don't cannot comment. You need to comment because this is the. They said this is your mother. Explain to me why your mother is giving us a full report with two extra details of what is coming of her vagina. I can't comment. I don't even know. I can't comment. Well, but cannot, there is one thing I can the comment Muslim, on. Not me. If you if you cannot comment, who will comment then? Al ulama. Okay, al ulama. So what did what does that mean? What the ulama said to you? You never ask any of them about this. Brother, we do not comment. We we okay. only question what what looks like something to question. The okay. ulama, whatever okay. they are saying, we me, take it. Me. Alhamdulillah. Asha, she reports for us that the woman she came to the prophet and there's a guy he is looking at her in a dirty way. And the prophet he said to her, suckle him. The woman she said, how I'm going to suckle him? And he is a grown man. What do you think about the story of Aisha? And after that, Aisha, she ordered her sisters to suckle anyone want to enter upon her. What do you say about that? If it is 100 of the same, Sahih. It is Sahih. I do not it, is, it is Sahih, brother. It's Sahih. So what do you say about that? Your prophet wife, if I want to go to enter upon her, I have to suck the nipples of her sister or the nipples of her nieces who they are women. Why is that? Allah, I don't, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Are you too proud? Most time you sing for me Quran, you are so proud, and suddenly you do not know. So you only are proud. Brother, of brother, Quran. Let me tell you. Something. No, you need to tell us why, what kind of religion. I cannot meet a woman. Imagine I go into a company and there's a woman I want to meet. In order to meet her, I have to suck the nipples of her nieces or the nipples of her sisters, and I have to suck them 10 different times in 10 different days. Why is that? Let me tell you something. Islam is more than just reading a little book on, East, on well, Google. You know, Islam is more stupid than I agree. It's the most stupid let me, religion. Let me, let let me, me, let me say something. Yes, but still, please. you cannot answer. Islam is so stupid to the point you are running away from answering. What kind of a no, no, I'm not running okay, away. I just want to ask you one let, question. Let, if let, it's me, let me tell you is it ethical to your wife to give her nipples with my respect to your wife? I'm not insulting, I'm asking a question about religion. Is it ethical for you? It's okay for you that if I'm, I want to see your wife, she have or to see you or to come to your house, she your wife with my respect to her, she have to let me sit in her lap and then I will suck her breast and I have to do it in 10 different days. Until I am satisfied, is that ethical for you, brother? To be honest with you, I don't know the context of this. I don't care about the context. There is no way you are a Muslim who recite the Quran for me. You never heard that of before. Okay, okay. You are being hypocrite now. There's no way. Are you saying to me? Are you saying to me? You are you saying to me? I am very unknowledgeable of my deen. Wallahi, to make, to make me believe you. that you are telling the truth, I swear by the faith. Wallahi, I am no, swear by the faith. The I don't believe. I don't know. By Allah, I could learn my no, no, deen. No, 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 no. Swear by something higher than Allah. Allah Himself is swear by the faith. You swear by the faith. Uh, swear by the faith. I don't. Uh, know. You know yourself swear that Allah is Allah. Swear you by know. the faith. I believe you. Say, I swear by the holy faith that I do not know. You know Allah is the only God. That's why you always try to. Well, Allah is him. the only God. He teach you that your wife she have to suckle everybody in the bus in order for the men to get in. Never. You what never ever God? talk about your this, own this God, the, the Messiah. This never. God, this is the God of the hippie, my friend. Your God is a hippie from California. Your God is a lousy. Your God is a hippie. Okay, a you, guy, can you translate the thing I read for you before, listen, please? Listen, uh, yeah, I will uh, translate. I will go. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. You want? Are you sure you want to translate well, what you said to me? Well, uh, mm. Okay, what does that mean? Surah Nisa. Well, uh, taqulu thalatha. Do not say three. In oh. okay. If you get away, it is better for you. So why Allah? Why Allah? In Quran, he keeps saying uh, uh, three. Inna Allah. Okay. Why? Why you Muslims? Why you Muslims? Why you Muslims? You keep saying three in the name of Allah, Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim. Why you cannot recite your Quran without saying three names? Why Allah? He in, uh, he said Alif Lam Mim three. Who is Alif and who is Lam and who is Mim? Who is Allah, who is Ar-Rahman, who is Ar-Rahim? Why you Muslims, you cannot start your religion without saying three? Why you do ablution by three? Why you fast three? Why you take an oath, you repeat the oath three so times? So are what? you admitting that you actually worship three gods? No, we don't worship three gods. It's you who follow three gods. There's no Christian believing. Wallahi, three gods. you worship There's three no gods. There's no Christian. Wallahi. You are a liar and you are a fool. And actually, even the Quran prove you wrong. Are you saying to me the Quran is a liar? 
Are you saying to me that the Quran says that Christians believe in three gods? I'm asking you, are you saying the Quran that the Christians believe in three gods? Does the Quran say that? The Quran is telling you not to say three gods, yes. Okay, where it says that? Surah Nisa. The verse you gave me, it doesn't say that. Surah Nisa, go to Surah Nisa if you are real man. Let us go and see the chapter of An Nisa. Give me the verse number so I will be sure that we are talking about the same verse. Go to the bottom, please. Go to the, the bottom. Bomb, the bomb, okay. I will show you the verse. We'll travel to the go bottom. Go to the bomb, okay. Go to the bomb, okay. Here we go. This is the bomb, okay. What about the bomb? To the bottom, bottom of the Surah Nisa. Yeah, please. the bomb of the Surah Nisa. The bomb, it's not in the bomb, it's 171. What bomb? This is in the middle. Go ahead. Yeah, uh, you do not know even what verse I know. You have no idea what verse you are talking about. No. Okay. okay. Well, I don't know the number of the verse. Okay, no Sorry. problem. I know, but you do not know. No problem. Now show no, me. Where, show this me, is not the where, verse. This is not the verse. Show me where it says. Show me where it says in the Arabic. Don't say there's a three gods. I want to see that. Okay, I am searching. Can you look at it, please? I can see the video. Can you look? It's in the front of you. Where it says, don't say three gods. Surah an Nisa and the ayah number is 171. <laughs> Where it says three gods. <laughs> okay, three what? Three Allah, three gods. There's no Christian belief first in Allah. What is in the Quran There's is no talking Christian about? The Quran is gods. talking about skies. No, it doesn't say even in the verse that we believe in three gods. You are a liar. Yes, it does. Okay. 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 So the Christian they believe in three gods according to Islam. Who are they? Al Masih. And who? The Holy Ghost. And who? Allah himself. Okay, so the Quran is a book of lies because the Quran never mentioned that the Christians believe in the Holy Ghost. The Quran says that the Christian they believe in you Islam. yourself oh, know you believe oh, in oh, three oh, gods. There's no up, question about it. Up. The Quran says that we believe in Mary and the Isa and Allah. Why you are saying the Holy Ghost? No, no, that's some of you, not all of you. No, 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 where it says that some of you are the lie. closest don't people lie, to the Muslims no, today no, no, on the no, earth no, when it comes no, to no, religion. No, no. Okay, but I promise okay. you that okay, you have long, left your path. As long as it is some of us, show us where in the Quran it says that the Christian they believe in the Holy Ghost as God. So you are saying the Quran saying some of the Christian believe in Mary as God and some they believe that the Holy Ghost is God. Is God. Show us where is the verse. Of where is the verse? Where is the verse? It says that the Christian believe in the Holy Ghost. I have no knowledge of a verse, no but the Walat Akulu Salasa is talking about three Allah, three gods busted. that you believe in. Let me get you busted. The Quran says in chapter 5, verse number 17. لقد كفر الذين قالوا إن الله هو الله المسيح ابن مريم نعم. So how we believe in three gods, but yet we say Allah is the Messiah. Explain that to us. Lord, whoever said Allah is the Messiah, Allah is lost. Okay. لقد كفر الذين قالوا. So Allah is lost. Allah is lost. No, whoever said the Messiah is Allah on this earth is Lord. You guys said that Allah is saying you have left. You have disbelieved. Hold on, Abdul, Mr. Fig. You are the one who says to me that the Quran says in chapter of An-Nisa, one verse, uh, verse uh, 171, that those who say there's three Allah, they are false. But in this verse, it says that the Christian believe that Allah and the Messiah is one. Yes. So how they are three and they are one? No, look, it says, لَقَدَ كَفَرَ الَّذِينَ قَالُوا إِنَّ اللَّهَ هُوَ مَسِيحَ بْنُ مَرْيَمَ You are recording that is machine. One, that is one thing. You are and then the other thing is, machine. وَلَا تَقُولُوا ثَلَاثَ Stop reporting. I want to answer. How one verse says, don't say three, and this verse says that the Messiah okay, okay. is the Lord. Okay, let me answer now, okay? Mm. It doesn't matter if it is the ghost or Mary. You still believe in three ghosts. That is 100. Get lost. I'm not going to waste. It doesn't matter. You see, it doesn't matter. This is not a question, you idiot. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. What matter is, it is a contradiction. One verse saying, don't believe in three. And the other verse saying that the Christian believe that Allah is the Messiah. How they are three, but Allah is the Messiah, that make them one. Not a three. <laughs> 
So the only way for them to escape, they say, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. You believe in three gods. No Christian believe in three gods and you are a liar like your prophet. Shame on you. Not a single Christian exists in this earth believe in three gods. If you go to the, the even we have the law, it's called the, the, the whole law of, uh, of Nicaea or Nicaea. It says that uh, uh, our God is one. The first sentence, we believe in one God. This is the first sentence of the law of the Christians, of the belief. We believe in one God. Stop lying. And now you showed us stupidity in the Quran. Your God, Allah, do not know what the Christians believe. He think they worship Mary as God. Nobody in this earth worship Mary as God. You want to say to me the Catholic they do? It's a lie. They don't. The Catholic believe in the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. As simple as that. 